lives. Run from Rafa, the way you ran from Gaza City, the way you ran from Jabalia, the way you ran from Deir al-Bala, the way you ran from Beit Hanun, the way you ran from Hanayunis. Run, or we will kill you. We will drop GBU-39 bombs on your tent encampments and set them ablaze. We will spray you with bullets from our machine gun equipped drones. We will pound you with artillery and tank shells. We will shoot you down with snipers. We will decimate your tents, your refugee camps, your cities, your towns, your homes, your schools, your hospitals, and your water purification plants. We will rain death from the sky. Run for your lives again and again and again. Pack up the few belongings you have left, blankets, a couple of pots, some clothes. We don't care how exhausted you are, how hungry you are, how terrified you are, how sick you are, how old you are, how young you are. Run, run, run. And when you run in terror to one part of Gaza, we will make you turn around and run to another, trapped in a labyrinth of death, back and forth up and down, side to side, six, seven, eight times. We toy with you like mice in a trap. Then we deport you so you can never return or we kill you. Let the world denounce the genocide. What do we care? The billions in military aid flows unchecked from our American ally, the fighter jets, the artillery shells, the tanks, the bombs, an endless supply. We kill children by the thousands. We kill women and the elderly by the thousands. The sick and the injured without medicine and hospitals die. We poison the water. We cut off the food. We make you starve. We created this hell. We are the masters, law, duty, a code of conduct. They do not exist for us. But first, we toy with you. We humiliate you. We terrorize you. We revel in your fear. We are amused by your pathetic attempts to survive. You are not human. You are creatures, undermensch. We feed our lust for domination. Look at our posts on social media. They have gone viral. One shows soldiers grinning in a Palestinian home with the owners tied up and blindfolded in the background. We loot rugs, cosmetics, motorbikes, jewelry, watches, cash, gold, antiquities, we mock your misery, we cheer your death, we celebrate our religion, our nation, our identity, our superiority by negating and erasing yours. Depravity is moral, atrocity is heroism, genocide is redemption.